name is François Aguila, so I'm in charge of the all European business for Printech, means for the printhead, inkjet printheads. So we are following this with our office base in France. And uh, yes, we are in charge of the sales and the marketing point for all the printheads in Europe. is something new for us. Uh, we started recirculation since now one year, so we have been developing this print, this print head, which is now available in the market. And the idea was to be able to use very high viscosity inks with pigmented inks, and in order to have a very high flow rate inside the print head with a recirculation technology. So this is something that now Seiko is pushing a lot in the market, because we want our print head to be open for a wider market, especially in different types of inks. working in uh, our labo with uh, some brain head already it means we have a solution already but our engineers are really trying to customize to make the print heads stronger in order to be not aggressive due to the water base and the idea is uh, the technology itself we already have in our hand the question is how we can make the print head reliable means for longer print and to be useful in the real industrial market and this is what we are trying to do now we are trying to modify some materials inside the print head in order to make it stronger and to be available. We hope normally by beginning of next year we should have uh, some first samples to be introduced to the market for water base. It's going to be maybe difficult. Or, uh, we will, might be introducing something with some of our partner, but it's not decided yet. We are, we are working on it. Yes, yes, of course, of course. Yeah. We are Seiko has been one of the first, let's say, manufacturer to be involved in the textile a long time ago. So we have a strong experience with the water base. Uh, it took time for us to develop some new product because we had some different idea of concept about the piezo construction and so on. For example, in this green head, the piezo construction is completely different than the previous one model. So now we are trying to be back, let's say, into this market. We are working with our former OEM partners and they are testing our head with different types of things. Of course, we have contact with ink manufacturer and we try to optimize the green head for, again, to be able to work with different types of things. One of the target will be the single pass. So, you know, this is one of the target for sure in the textile industry. Everyone is talking about single pass. Uh, we don't believe that single pass could replace all the market for textile. It's maybe too difficult and maybe not the right way for, for demanding on the market. But we, we hope that this green head, because of recirculation, because of high frequency, because of flexibility on the drop size that you can control with the waveform, can offer a flexibility and good advantage for OEMs to develop and to produce single pass printer. One of the targets will be with pigment because of the recirculation again. So you can really optimize the print head and you can start to use such kind of high pigmented ink. Maybe also with higher viscosity we are working on. So this is something that we really want. There is yeah, some possibility, there is some possibility, yes. We are working on quite strong and we want at least to show something new in the market with our green head. So there is a target, at least from our side there is a target for that.